Well, the new iPhone 16 arrives next week. Should Apple users upgrade now or wait a bit? Here's consumer reporter John Matteris and his Don't Waste Your Money report. The new iPhone is almost here. Apple has just announced the date for its major announcement, which has a lot of people wondering, is it time for an upgrade? Remember the thrill when Apple would unveil a new phone? Those days in the long lines outside the Apple store faded in recent years, but the company is hoping for renewed excitement with the release of the iPhone 16 with its faster chips. Cell carriers will be offering great promo deals on the new 16, which should start around $800. But tech sites from Mac Rumors to Tom's Guide to Gizmodo all suggest the 16 won't be a major update. They say if your phone works well, you might want to wait for next year's 17. A better deal? You'll find huge sales on the outgoing 15 in the next few weeks. But from the doesn't that stink file, why iPhones older than an 11 are running out of time. ZDNet says the phone has a planned lifespan of only five years. The iPhone 8 is no longer supported and support will end for the X next year. Repair shop owner Bashar al Vustani says iPhone 13s and 14s are still fine, but he says older phones are starting to slow down. And you compare it between the 11 and the 12, you'll see the difference. So if you're in the bubble, consider a markdown 15. Now, if money's tight and you can't afford the latest, greatest iPhone, late September is still a great time to buy an older model phone at a deep discount. As always, don't waste your money. I'm John Matteris, ABC 27 News.